Hello everybody and welcome back to Pumpkin Days. Let's learn a recipe this morning. Rhubarb cake. Yum, 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 yum. I like rhubarb. It's really, really delicious. Okay, so the thing I am going to be doing today looks like the animals have got a reasonable amount of food. There's no poops everywhere. So I think I probably did that before I went to bed. So what I want to do today is I'm just going to have a quick look in here. Oh my goodness, we've got so much stuff in this inventory. But I've still got my boxes. Do you know what? I'm going to do something. Okay. And I know I probably I probably should be emptying my inventory out first. But I have a feeling that... Uh, well, I'm going to check first quickly down here. I have a feeling that my... Well, actually, no, I know, because I checked it last time, didn't I? I remember now. But the um, the spring crops are ready, but the summer ones are not yet. And I want, obviously, the fields where there's a spring and summer crop. I want them all to be ready at once, so I can just go and harvest the whole thing. I wonder if I need more boxes. <laughs> I'm going to have a lot going on. You guys are saying I can uh, stack fridges on top of fridges inside the processor sheds. So that's going to be a thing that I'm going to try out as well. But... I want to go and plant vanilla down in uh, Spoonie Island. So I'm going to head down to Wahoo Beach. And obviously I'm much faster at doing this on my horse. On my beautiful Momo horse. Um, I'm going to just grab all the fruit down there. Then I'm going to try a little thing that you guys have been saying. That there's a certain uh, path that goes straight to Spoonie Island from my one plot to another from my jungle plot to the Spoony Island plot. So I want to try that out as well uh, because apparently I don't need to go all the way around the beach and get stuck on all the annoying bits of the beach and stuff. So I'm going to try that out. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is put down a box ready for me to put things into because there's no doubt gonna have to um and honestly in that box oh no this is already full of stuff well oopsie also why aren't these ones glowing okay well i'll pop these away Loads of stuff already in my inventory as well. Uh, this, this could be this could be tight, but oh well, we'll, we'll try it. <laughs> right, let's get the old uh, fruit picker out. Worst comes to the worst, I'll just go to the home improvement store and buy more boxes. <laughs> just have an inventory full of boxes. I feel like in this game, there's so much uh, at, at this sort of level as well. There's, there's, you need all the help you can get, don't you, really? And papayas. I might get to a point as well where I just sort of um, leave these spring-summer fruits a bit longer and maybe just concentrate on the ones that I don't have as much of. I'm not sure, but all I know is I want to make some vanilla. That's all I know. And also, I think while I'm doing that, I'll probably try and... I mean, I think it's raining today, so hopefully it is raining on Smoothie Island as well. But I'm hoping as well that I can maybe um, try and put some life into my into my trees and my ginger... No, not my ginger, my um, dragon fruit trees. I'm hoping I can get some life into those because I think I've been neglecting them quite, poor, quite badly and it's uh, resulted in them... You know, not uh, fruiting. So I'm going to try and see if I can get them to, to revive. <laughs> it's going to be a bit of a nightmare. But what I'll do is I'll just grow vanilla down there, pop down there every day and uh, water the vanilla, water those trees every morning. Because the lavender is all good. I don't need to do anything up there um, except if I want to take things up to grind. Up in Diamond Falls. So I don't need to go up to Diamond Falls except for harvesting trees. So I can probably focus a lot more my attention down here. And also on um, taking quests and things. 
Now, you guys have said that uh, several times that I need to, t to take, like, a quest for... Or, or try and make friends with Corin down on Spoonie Island. So that's something that I'm going to try and do as well. And you said that you're trying not to... Tr Thank you all for trying not to give me spoilers. You're saying that there's something quite game-changing about making friends with Corrin. So that's something I'm going to try really hard to do. So I'll try and find them today and uh, introduce myself. Introduce myself to maybe as many of the Spoony Islanders as I can. But as I say, working mostly on trying to, to make Corrin my friend. Because apparently that's something that is good to do. So I'll try that. It'd be nice to, like, maybe just get to know everybody if possible, but... But obviously taking any quest is going to be a good one, as long as I can, you know, do the quest fairly easily, because I th that's, people were saying as well that the Spoonie Islanders all like each other, so they're all like a big community, so that really helps you with making friends with them. So that's also pretty cool. So thank you all for, for that information. I was vague enough that it's not... I don't feel like it's a huge spoiler, but it's it's helpful, so... Oh, no, we're all full up. Darn it. Why did I put the box down over there? Man. I've got to run all the way over. That was a dumb move, wasn't it? It's also only got like two spaces in it. Lovely. Okay, well. Clearly gonna need the other box now, aren't I? Uh, so I did the bananas, I did these, I did those. And I just have these to do. Okay, that's fine. Hopefully this one is empty. Yes. <laughs> well, that'll save my bacon, I think. I'm going to need to get those sorted before I have to do the big pumpkin veil orchard because that's the biggest one. It's the most um, tightly spaced one. Oh, by the way, I did notice in the comments, OD, ODX is going to be doing an entire field, or has done, of something like 120 ginger dragon trees. Is that full already? Oh, gee. 120 ginger dragon trees, and apparently it's something like over a million a harvest for them. It wouldn't surprise me if I sold everything off that I had if I if I had nearly a million in gems and uh, food stuffs, all that sort of thing. But I probably will start selling the um, banapples and grapples again because they were really good sellers. That's maybe where, where ODX got the idea from. The idea that, you know, I was taking things 30 a time of a hybrid fruit and, and then saw the ginger dragons and thought, they're tiny, put two and two together and thought, hmm, this is the way. <laughs> maybe that'll be something for my final plot. Although I can't imagine how annoying that will be to harvest. <laughs> I think you may have, may have made a rod for you in back there, mate. Okay, so anyway. Let's head over. Ooh. Now, I think this is the path that you guys mean. So I'm going to follow this and see if it pops me out at Spoony Island. And I'm going to go and say hello to some of the dudes down there, hopefully. So I, I believe it is this path. Ooh, okay. Going up a mountain, and should we? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, I was like, are you sure this is right? We're going up a mountain here, but no, it, it really is. It's completely correct. Lovely. Very nice indeed. So, what I want to do here, I want to have a little look at the notice board, see if there's any quests that I can do for people. So, let's have a look. Cranberry bread. No, I can't do that unless I have... Oh, do I have the recipe? I have no idea. If I have the recipe, I can do it with a substitution. I'm not going to worry about that then. Boiled eggs, I can do that. 
chocolate cherry jam cookies. That sounds incredibly uh, complicated. Sugar should be absolutely fine though. Common crab. I don't know if I have that. So we'll we'll just do those for today because I've got I do have a lot on my plate. Let's just go and have a chat to some peeps. Just get to know them. Hey, uh... Have you seen Luke? Fifteen. Easily distracted. Talk your ear off. No. I'm sure he'll be home when he's hungry. I'll just do some crafting while he's playing fetch. I love how much help I got on Spoonie Island. I'm not sure how I'd manage without this community. With everyone working together, we all have a life. Nice. Have a chat to these two. Hey, friend. I haven't seen you around before. Welcome to the neighbourhood. My name's Tony. If you see a dog running around, that'd be Luca. Hope you're not allergic to either of us at that. Uh, well, I'm not up for much, but Luca down here is right... Sorry, here is downright useful. So if you ever need a hand, let us know. We'll see what we can do. Perfect. No, and touchy. Meredith. You may not th Sorry, you may not think getting a purse to the face is a big deal, but I bought this special tactical purse. Just press this button. Spikes. Okay. Photography is another love of mine. Sometimes the world is just too much, but the camera only allows a limited angle of view. You can narrow your perspective and literally focus on the final details before you. Hey, uh... My boy Luke is in the school play. Oh, that's you again. He's Cora Spoonie number three, which I'm pretty sure is the lead. <laughs> hey there! I don't think so. My name's Olive. I run a bakery here with my brother Forrest. He's been baking for years and started teaching me when I was just a kid. We decided this would be the best location for a bakery. My side of the bakery is gluten-free. It has to be, because I'm celiac and can't even touch gluten without getting sick. Hope you'll come by and try some samples. Well, hey. I'm Forrest. I live here with my sister, Olive. We run the specialty bakery in town. She takes care of all the gluten-free orders and I do the rest. I love a good challenge, so if there's something you've been craving but haven't been able to eat because of a certain ingredient, let me know. I've always loved baking, and as we grew up with a... Sorry, we both ended up having different dietary issues and started doing a lot of experimenting with substituting ingredients. I chose to bake because there was no profession I could put my trivia skills to good use in. All this knowledge of inane subjects has nowhere to go. If only I could make money off knowing a person could fit inside a blue whale's artery. <laughs> you probably could, just do something on YouTube. Okay. Who are you? Howdy, buckaroo. Frogman, where the people are tired and the beds are comfortable. We're a close-knit group who have abandoned health-related stigmas. All are welcome here who do the same. You'll find copious amounts of compassionate comrades and the fluffiest of pillows to rest your fair weary head. Sorry, your fairy head? Your fairy head? <laughs> Looks like uh, there's nobody. Oh no, here's uh, Lan. Hi. I see you're not registered in my memory, so you must be new. My name is Lan. I'm the doctor here on Spoonie Island. Most residents here have most medical needs, so I am here to take care of everyone. I'm really good at medicine, but I'm not very good at reading emotions, so forgive me if I respond inappropriately. I hope we can be friends. Okay, so have I got all of these people in my journal now? Spoonie Island. Oh no, I don't have Olive or Lan. I need to speak to them twice, I guess. How are you doing? Be sure to say hello to all the residents here at Spoonie Island. Everyone here is really friendly. Need anything? Can you do me a favour? I need uh, to return a CD belonging to Tony. Deliver it for me, please. Sure. Thank you very much. Just see if I can find Tony. And Tony was at the cafe, so I'm hoping, hoping they're still there. No, they're not. Okay. Uh. Delivery for Tony. Tony will be in Tony's house, no doubt. Sleeping. So we'll have to give that to Tony tomorrow. Oh no, that seems to open. Oh no, no, it doesn't now. Okay. Darn it. Okay, uh, looks like they were just letting Luca out. <sighs> okay. So I think at this point, um, all the Spoonie Island folk are abed, so it's time now to do some farming over here, which is what I wanted to do today. So I need to find a spot kind of big enough that I can squidge in. And I think I can... No! Oh, that's irritating. 
can't quite squidge in a big plot here. Oh, but I can, I can here, look. Just here. Go on, let's do this thing. And then I want to plant down all of my vanilla seeds. Oh, Meredith's here, although I know Meredith. Um, pop those down. Might actually be handy to have a, a seed maker down here, but yeah, that that'll just have to do. I just have to squidge it in, <laughs> and then I'm going to sort of grab a few. I hope I've got enough room. I think I should have. To harvest this all down, and once I've done that, I can then take a look at harvesting. Well, uh, actually, as long as uh, this is all harvested by the 6th, then that's when I'm going to be doing the other three lots. So two lots today and then three more on the 6th. But that's going to be a big, like a really big harvest. So I kind of need to think about what I want to do with all of this stuff in the meantime and possibly make more fridges and that sort of thing. Maybe go and cut down a couple more redwood trees, uh, make some more fridges, maybe buy another storage box or two. I'm kind of resigned. I was a little bit like, oh, surely that's cheating. And now I've realized quite how much there is to transport around when you do get to this sort of mass producing stage. I'm like, I don't think you could do it without the boxes, honestly. Especially not with the sort of centralized storage I've got. I mean, maybe if you just had like um, your each one of your places had um, a small processor shared with fridges and stuff in it, that might work. I'm quite excited to be doing some some like social work, social work? <laughs> social um, gameplay, I guess, around Spoony Island. I know a lot of you are very excited for me to be friends with Alex as well because there's something I can get off her. I'm just struggling a little bit with what to make her for a present. So, But I am actively trying to take quests, even if they're a little bit more difficult from her, unless I'm fairly sure that I won't be able to do them because obviously then I don't want to risk losing the friendship points. Yeah, pretty soon. As I say, I think I might wait till maybe the autumn time because the autumn time is when things are going to start to calm down in terms of uh, all of the orchards and stuff. I think that might be the best time to have my little baby. So we'll go through the summer. So we'll do another few episodes of summer. I will sort of chat to... Oh no, those are back to saplings. They're tiny now. That's a nightmare. But I don't think they need watering today, do they? Oh, and there we are with those. Uh, let's grab the box. I don't know which one's full and which one isn't now. That one's full. So that one isn't? Yeah, that's right. So just give it a couple of lines free in my inventory there, then that should be fine. We've planted the vanilla. So once we're done with the, the plots, I can go back home and uh, start putting stuff away, check on all my stuff, whether it needs watering down in Pumpkin Vale. I've got a few things growing over there. Put stuff away and um, then maybe make a start, although I might not be able to do that until tomorrow, but it's fine if I can't uh, make a start on some of my quest stuff. I'll be back down here tomorrow. Especially now I know a good way to come down here. That's brilliant, actually. But I'll be back down here tomorrow um, for okay, for watering the vanilla and also watering these trees. So I'm just going to quickly grab my watering can and just check that they don't need watering, which they don't. So they should be back into sort of a, a growth stage now, hopefully. They're just going backwards and backwards and backwards. The more they're not getting watered, though. Yeah, it is raining, so... 
That's fine. That's all perfect. Come here, Momo. Let's go home. I want to time it as a Momo. Ah. It's quite dark and, and Momo sort of blends in sometimes. You're a dark horse. Hee hee hee. So what I want to know is how long it takes. It's 10.06 right now. So let's say we started at 10. How long it takes me to ride back using this method? Ooh. Now this doesn't look like the same trail that I was on before. This is the one that comes out sort of I'm going to be going home cross country here, but I'm, uh, what I need to do is work out how to get to that little, that little trail. Oh no! Well, that seemed to work. We've taken an hour so far, even though I got completely lost. So that's not too bad. Okay. me just over just over an hour to get back I reckon I could do that quicker if I took the right path though because that was a bit crazy okay so what what did I want to do I wanted to I wanted to not be here did I I wanted to be down here putting things away in my fridge and then possibly also watering these because uh, my, my friendo hasn't done it for me today Oh no. Come here. So I'm basically doing the, the shipping quota here, plus a couple of extra things that I thought would be useful, like my wasabi crop. Probably won't repeat the, the wasabi crop. This is uh, oats. I never managed to properly um, multiply those up. Oh really? I'm zuzzing already? Okay, well, I guess I'll go to bed, and then tomorrow will be spent, um, other than doing the vanilla uh, watering and, and going to see people down in uh, Spoonie Island. So that'll just be a little quick, a little quick stop. I can save a little bit of time riding down there, but I, I don't know exactly how much time I save, really. So I like to be in this one because uh, Momo has a little stable here, so. Well, I always go to sleep up here if I can. So let's grab a recipe and head to bed with Sebastian. I might take away the second bed. I don't think it's needed. Raisin bread. Nice. So that'd be grapes, I expect. Mad tasty, apparently. Okay, so let's sleep until, yeah, 5.47. It'd be fine. I'm going to need to feed the animals th tomorrow as much as possible. Um, I think Sebastian might have helped me, though, already. I need to wait a, just a couple minutes. And then we're going to spend, as I say, a little bit of time just going down to Spoonie Island. And we'll, I'll take the sugar and the um, scrambled eggs down. In fact, I could make those now. Oh, did I accidentally press crafting? I must have done Salisbury steak. I used to live near Salisbury. One potato ockle. Potato cool. That's probably something I will never make in my life. <laughs> okay, so let's see if we can make some boiled eggs at least. Oh, 
Oh, was it boiled or scrambled? Ooh, I do not remember. I've got the delivery for Tony to do as well, so I need to do that as quickly as I can. I need to make sure I've got some sugar in my inventory as well, which I do. So that's fine. That's a couple of things to, to hand into those guys, which is fantastic. I do need to feed these guys as well. The Spoonie Island guys won't be up for a while, though. So it'd be, it'd be good for me just to sit and make recipes for... Uh, well, I'll do all the feeding and, and watering. Give out a couple of presents around here. I don't think I have anything for Rose at the moment. Except, I, I, yeah, BLT for her, but other than that. I don't know how to make bacon. I mean, mo I know that bacon is pig meat, so I'm figuring that you make it out of pork somehow. And we're out of fodder today as well. Okay. Today might be a good day to go see Alex. How are the dog food bowls doing? They're both empty, so let's uh, get those done. I, I think I'm going to go with a rule of um, two bowls per animal. It's, it's very useful. But I think Spoonie Island is 11 to 3 is a good... It's a good sign over there. It's, it's a good sort of timing to have for them. And I'll just be... Um, I'll, I'll water the ginger... Not the ginger, the, the dragon fruit trees. I will water those and I will water the vanilla down there. And then I'll go and give them presents. Momo! Mo, you're in the way. Watering these is, is definitely a lot easier. What are those? Ah, raspberries. Okay. So everything's looking pretty good over here. Pop that away. Um, so I'm going to start off with my cheese pizza then. So I think I have some dough. Yeah. I hope it was any one we wanted. One cheese pizza, that's fine. Unpolished topaz. Ooh, cheese. Do I have cheese just in my inventory right now? Yes, I do. A pepperoni pizza times two. Okay, well, let's see if pepperoni pizza is on the... No, apparently I do have the stuff for that. So two pepperoni pizzas coming right up. At least sugar for Lucas. We've got that. Fries for Nicholas. Fries, vegetable dishes, I think they're under, aren't they? Fries, 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 fries. How many? Just one. Mayonnaise for Alec, I've already got on me. Turnip fries for Harsha. Should get through a lot of these today, hopefully. I did press three. Is my num lock on? Oh, I don't have any cooking oil. Right, okay. I need to sort that out then. Um, I should be able to do light cheat ice cream though. Two of those. I did the boiled eggs. Okay, this list is so huge that I think that I've done enough there just for now. I'm just going to start giving things out to people. So, cheese pizza for Komoko to start with. I always feel better when the list is smaller and then I can just be a bit more like... I don't know. Doesn't feel as bad somehow. So, I don't know... Oh! Hi, sorry if I'm bothering you. I just wanted to tell you that um, you're the most amazing person in the world and I uh, don't know how you put up with someone like me for all this time. I'm doing better, but uh, I'll still be a downer sometimes. However, despite all that, you took the time and effort to be my friend and um, I know it must have been difficult. I made something for you. 
so much, but instead of grilled fish, I've been trying to cook something nice on the bonfire. I hope you like it. Oh, salmon cakes. That's so nice of you. Thank you, sweetheart. Right, Komoko, I think it's just a little bit. Komoko's entire house is surrounded by flowers. Okay, Komoko is sleeping, so right. Let's move on to the next one then, which is Lily to cheese. Lily should be up. And then Eddie pepperoni pizza. Anyways, I'll be able to find Komoko on the way back. She's up like super late. Oh, um, thanks, I think. I don't remember buying this, but I don't want it, so I guess you can have it. Okay, let's get out of here and go find Eddie. Brown carpet. It sounds kind of gross, but maybe I could use it for something else other than just carpeting. So. It's usually pretty free with what you can do. Cool. So, oh, you're back already. Well, in return, you can have this, man. Shauna wants me to throw out my old clothes, but I'd rather give it to a friend. So I'm going to get some clothes again now. I have to shovel that in my wardrobe. An orange collared shirt. All right. I think I'm now going to head down to Spoonie Island. I've got several days to give the things in to most of these guys, so it's fine. I'm just going to see. So 10.30 we started out. I'll see how fast I can make it. And I, I seem to remember that it, actually, if I go this way, if I'm going directly to Spoonie and I'm not going to Jungle Plot, this is usually the way to go. Ten fifty one, fifty two. I'm going to try this. I think I'm going well off course now. Yeah, hugely off course. That's not great. Oh, darn. I'm still trying to learn my way, um, learn the best ways to go in things, and sometimes I, I muck up, so... I'm going to be there short of 12 at this point. Where did I go wrong? It was somewhere that I needed to, to turn, really. Yes, yeah, so I needed to somehow just catch into this um, jiggle jungle trail or whatever it's called. Something jiggly. Yeah, still took an hour and a half. I got a bit lost. I think I can do this in an hour if I'm really quick. And it's raining again today, so that's fantastic. These guys are still sitting there as saplings. Um, that means also my vanilla saplings will be being rained on, so that's great. Okay, so I need to find Tony. For the delivery, so that's you. Hey, friend. I love mermaids. That's not interesting. Sorry, that's not interesting. It's just a fact. Shark mermaids, the best. Okay, take it to Lucas now. Where's Lucas? Is Lucas asleep? This is in Lucas's house. Oh man. Okay, so we're gonna wait for Lucas to get out of there. And also for the sugar. Oh, that sucks. Come out. Um, so let's see if we can find Corin then. In the meantime, and then I'll have a look at the board as well while we're waiting for Lucas to come back out. So Corin is behind. Oh, okay. Hello. People tell me you're a cool dude, so. Oh, you are a cool dude, actually. You look really cool. 
good. Why is everything on top of seeing what he said? Okay. What you need. The rain actually helps me go to sleep. See what you need. Old. Uh, did you say something? I'm sorry. I didn't hear it. Love that character model, though. That's so cool. So now I should have a little bit, my first little bit of of help with with Corin. But oh yeah, it looks like I've got a tiny, tiny, weeny bit of uh, stuff with everyone else as well. Now I don't know if they're gonna just stick inside the houses all day because it's raining. Vodka for Maya Fern. I can do that. Unpolished. Ooh, Chris Collar. I don't know about that. Brandy, I've forgotten how to make. Apple bread, I can absolutely do. Russian tea cakes, I have no clue. Please don't be a rose. Thanks. Ah, nice. Okay. Through the wall worked there. Apparently I have to be off my horse to do that. Pink doily party with wallpaper. Oh, you know what also? Let's see if we can give him the sugar. I have sugar for you. Thanks. Okay, now I know you're totally awesome. I can actually... Now I know that you're awesome. I can totally give this to you. Thanks. Friendship plus 20. Six friendship points with everybody else. And 16 wheat. Oh, cool. And 30 gold. Double cool. Okay, so I need to head back now. I'll check out the... Um, I'm going to see if I can find my way back again properly this time. I don't know. I might just try and like head in the right direction and see where I poke out. So it's definitely this. For a certain amount of time anyway. So we started at like three, something like that. And I think I need to just come up here. And then just see if I can kind of catch on to the... Well then just like really parkour my way down. Past the museum and then I catch the trail up here. That's then only taken like half an hour. That does seem to be the best way, actually. Just ride up the hill and just parkour down and try and like head to the right while I'm doing it so that I don't have to go all the way around the, the back there. That seems to be the way. But you guys, I believe I am also missing one maze somewhere. There's a maze somewhere that I haven't found. And apparently there's possibly something to do with a ghost somewhere as well. And these are all things that apparently I have not found. And I, I should be able to find, hopefully. I don't know. How are we doing with Tierra and, and all of my family's relationships right now? Sebastian's up to 14, so he's doing plenty of jobs for me now. Kimoko and Tierra. Look to be at 10, but Tierra might be a tiny bit off it. I'm not sure. Got loads of animals up to 10 now. Allison's up to 10 as well. The chickens, those original chickens are all up to 10, which is fantastic. So we're doing really well with the animals, even though I'm not paying them maybe as much attention as I should be. May of Fern's birthday. Oh, no. All right, let's have a look. The topaz for rose needs to be given in in three days. Flower. Should be able to do that. Matsu, I've no idea what that is. Chrysa praise, I'm sure I've got that. Potato and corn soup. I could try and make that. Milk cake, no idea how to make that. And raw iron, I should easily be able to do that. Okay, so let's just uh, go and find Kimoko and give her the cheese pizza, and then I'll try and find something for Rose. And again, I think people were saying that you can give her presents through the wall. If not, then I'll, I'll, 
I'll have to come back at a more appropriate time. And then we've got the iron. Um, so all the things that are like between three and six days to hand in. Then I also have fries for Nicholas as well. Okay, so let's go find Kimoko. There's some things that I've already made, I've got in my inventory already, so I may as well. Kimoko's with her friends down at the cemetery again. I'll have a chat to Gelfie again, because I never get uh -huh. to chat to Gelfie. Everyone is scared of something. Soon I'll find out what that thing is for you too. My gratitude. There's your cheese pizza. And I don't really need to be doing um, things for Komoko particularly. However, I get plus six with all their friends, so that's quite useful. Okay, so I don't have the stuff for Rose or Sister Joan or Flower for Luke. Do I have Flower in my inventory? No, I don't. So we'll go for fries uh, and mayonnaise. And the turnip fry. No, we don't have the turnip fries. We've got the lychee ice cream as well, don't we? So let's go for the fries. Surely this should be making some good inroads into people's uh, love of me pretty soon, though. Nicholas might already be at home. Nicholas lives all the way down here. It's this little flower shop. Oh no, it's still in the flower shop, so that's cool. Oh, it's not cool because he's not. He's in there, but he's not. Oh no. Dude, I got stuff for you. Come on out. That might have to be done tomorrow then, irritatingly. Where's Alec then? Alec's on the move, so let's see if we can go find him. On the move. Hello, I got stuff for you. Oh, that's to KO. Still, I can find your lost key. That's cool. And there's Alec. Thanks a bunch. There's your mayonnaise. Here, I figure this would look good in your place. You're giving me something to put in my house. Chaos lost key. In the fields outside Pumpkin Vale to the west across the bridge. Ooh. Well, that's going to be quite the find, I guess. Um, and then I need de des desperately need to get that topaz for Rose. So somewhere in these fields, is it? Aha. We found the quest location. Just have to find the thing. So we'll probably end up picking up a load of flowers on the way. Oh, there it is. There's the key. Okay, so we can take that back to Takeo now. Hopefully he hasn't moved. No, they're having a little Dr. Vet meeting okay. out here. So that was quite an easy one. Three... What are they? Italian salad. Mmm. Okay, we can try again and see if I can catch Nicholas. Because um, I can get into that house because it's Sebastian's old house. Uh, this is extremely annoying, honestly. Oh no, he's out. He's out and about. Quick, 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 quick. Where'd he go? 
Oh, this is Lily's house. What? Did I accidentally click on Lily? No, I did not. Aha! Nicholas was hiding around the back. Thank One for you. eyes. Lovely, Bonita. Wait there, I have the most beautiful thing for your home. Here, this is for you. I've got a couple of things for my home now, haven't I? Some uh, blue snow holiday pattern wallpaper, some brown carpet. Got an orange shirt. At some point I'll probably have to go and sell all the clothes as well. Okay, so now it's getting on a little bit in time, so I'm thinking that now might be a good time to just go and clean out my inventory a little bit. As much as humanly possible. Ah, I forgot where I was. Hang on. Clean out my inventory as much as humanly possible. Including putting all the little bits of clothes away, all the little bits of wallpaper away. la di da di da I think that's my wasabi done. Uh, pretty much. So I'm just going to head in here. But yeah, apparently I can stack, double stack these refrigerators. <laughs> Might be something I'll have to consider. That'll be hilarious. Okay, so let's have a look. Green fruits. Definitely got some green fruits here. And the coconuts are going in this one, I think, at the moment with all the purple and red fruit. Peaches, yeah, they're going in there too. Oranges will probably go in with the yellow fruit. And we've got some nuts. I'll put them in there's just the nut overflow fridge. That'd be just nut fridge number two, I guess. And then I've got to get through all of this. It's just lots of bits and pieces of things, which is a bit annoying, so... I've got honey here. Jam needs to get sold. There's a few cooked items as well, actually. Chamomile flowers can go there. Flour and sugar, I can put that wheat in. Um, for some reason, I still have a stack of breadfruit there. I'm thinking just to get stuff out of my inventory at the moment. I gave in the mayonnaise, so I don't need that right now. And I can go inside and put away like my seeds and then I can sell spare stuff. I don't know. Put away foods that have been given to me, like herb fish, Italian salad, plum jam. Um Keep the cheese there. I've got all sorts of stuff for the house. Which I don't know, I'll put in one of these cupboards maybe? I have no idea. Yeah, this seems to be for house stuff, so I'll put all the wallpapers and stuff away in there. Um, for some bizarre reason I've still got unpolished marble here. Oh look, I've got Salmon cakes and spicy chicken to go in the fridge as well. I honestly might put the vegetarian pizzas. Actually, no, I can eat those though. So, uh, parsley and thyme can go in the fridge. Salt can go in the fridge. I've then got some clothes to put away. I'm just trying to get this inventory less insane crazy full. Now we're out of space. Actually, that wallpaper should go in here. Okay, we are looking better now. Starting to, anyway. Okay, so let's head back outside and put a couple of herbs away in the fridge. Herbs, 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 herbs and honey. That needs to be sold, that needs to be sold. Those I have no idea really. Um, 
Those I think need to be sold. And that coin. But I don't think they're needed for the library. No. Salt needs to go away somewhere. Where do I even put salt nowadays? Uh, did I put salt in here at any point? Yes, I did. Okay, cool. So the salt's gone. The camellia's gone. Then I've got a couple of things that need to go away in the gem chest. So they all need to go in that processor shed there. That needs to be sold as well. All those strawberry juice I made. Those actually need to be put away. Hoop sacks. And we've got... Oh, no. I'm missing a box. So there'll be a box full of produce probably down at Spoonie Island. Probably Spoonie Island, but I'm not sure. So we'll have to go look for that. Um, I'll keep the bread because I need to make some apple bread and things. Okay. I'll go over to the cell box quickly. It's, it's just annoying when you have to do all this, like fiddly putting away i don't mind putting away all the vegetables and things but all of this is just really fiddly i want to try out all of these things for my so that needs to stay food needs to stay the sugar could go away disaster dish can get sold yeah, I like to see what things are before I decide I'm going to sell them. Like, if they're, like, see if they're a nice thing for my house or if they're just, like, rubbish. But I am sort of running out of room. So I'm going to need to make some more space at some point. So I'll put away my Kratos seeds, but I'm also going to put away the yellow curtains and the antique table and stuff in here. Then I'm going to go to the processor shed where I have my sawmills and stuff and put things away there as well. We're very close to a few harvests over here too. I'm getting very tired. But that's okay. I don't know where, where I really put sand, honestly. I guess I can put it in there somewhere. Unpolished marble and polished emerald would definitely go in there. And planks definitely go in there. I have fencing all over the place. I'm not really sure I'm even going to apologise for that, honestly. <laughs> okay, I think it's bedtime. We've done a lot today. It's it's been a good it's been a good run. We did a lot of social stuff today. It's always when I'm really tired and I've got zuds coming off me all over the place that I uh, realise I've got a load of stuff to pull up a load of uh, stuff to clean up on the farm then but that's also okay we'll do that in the morning kumquat pie Ooh, nice all right let's uh let's do a sleep i'm gonna have a little drink as well and that, my friends, is the end of that particular episode i'll be doing a bit more now so we'll be uh, picking up a recipe cleaning up the farm Go to Alex and grab some fodder. And then uh, continue with all of these quests. Obviously, Unpolished Topaz for Rose is the most important one. And then we'll we'll go through in order of importance. Um, also trying really hard to do anything that I've picked up for the people down in Spoonie Island. So uh, the, the apple bed for forest, for example. But that's it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves. And keep being awesome.